Fort Stewart, U.S. Army Medical Activity Soldiers participated in a staff ride to Fort Pulaski National Monument, March 10th. The purpose of the visit to Pulaski was to further the professional development of medical company soldiers, DA civilians, and leadership. They did it a lot when the fort was manned. But while encouraging the study of the medical profession through the history of the American Civil War. Yeah, the tour allowed MEDAC leadership to network with younger enlisted soldiers and take a moment to reflect on the past. We get so busy with our day-to-day -day mission, our routines, our duties, and yes, even our personal lives, we forget what happened to bring us where we're at now. No one expected a long war. Lieutenant Colonel Mark Mitchell, dressed in a recreation of a uniform that would have been worn by the Common Army of Northern Virginia during the Civil War, provided a history brief about the fall of Fort Pulaski to Menak leadership, soldiers, and DA civilians during the visit. I want them to take away the fact that this was the most destructive war in our history and that in many ways it actually took this war to bring us together as a nation. A substantial five-sided construction, Fort Pulaski was established in the 1830s and 1840s at the mouth of the Savannah River. Pulaski was built to provide protection to the city of Savannah from naval attack during the Civil War. The soldiers who manned the walls of the immense fort were not unlike the soldiers that towards historic walls today. It gives me a lot of perspective in the fact that they were brave enough to be able to do that and strong enough into what they believed to be able to go out there and fight this war, which makes me want to go out and try and better myself to be able to, you know, do this for my country. Besides a Civil War history brief provided by Mitchell and Sergeant First Class Jesse Jocelyn, the Menak team were led on a tour of the brick and mortar fort and told of the interesting stories it holds within its walls. This is probably my fourth trip out to Fort Pulaski, and every time I come out here, I learn something new. The gentleman who led the tour did an outstanding job, and it just amazes me, this massive, massive masonry fort that took over a decade to build, and it fell in 30 hours. The experience touring Pulaski provided the Menak team with the ability to reflect, kindle, and reinforce their interest in the heritage of the U.S. Army. For Wynn Army Community Hospital Public Affairs, I'm Zach Randstrom.